Duval County technology is instrumental to the growth of students in the classroom. The biggest challenges, especially in the last few years, were the changing environment. Prior to us having Step CG, a lot of our outages resulted in us actually having to contact the Florida Department of Education to get testing extensions because of the network outages during testing time for state exams. Since Step CG, we have not had one failure in our network. Our teachers want to teach cutting edge technology. The teachers want to be able to have these different options besides just a, just a textbook. And to, and to have those options, you have to make things very simple and that they have to work every day. Because the most frustrating thing that teachers can go through is if something doesn't work. And it doesn't take long for somebody to abandon something that it's hard or it's difficult to work with. So it's important that when the students come in, they sit in the classroom, they go grab their laptop, they open it up, they power it up, it hooks up to the network work they've got pure bandwidth and there's not any issues because issues just push people away from technology so it's important for us to make things as easy as they can be for the teacher and for the students so they can rely on that technology and then they'll continue to use it each and every day if they can rely on it. When Step CG got involved, we increased the robustness in the network tremendously. Uh, and it was through them coming up with a design that did exactly what we needed it to do to be resilient. So we put a plan together to put in an infrastructure that was a next generation infrastructure that not only would give them what they need from a secure, reliable, uptime and running standpoint, but also the capability of monitoring and understanding what's going on in the infrastructure that if there was an issue, they could easily remediate. I think a lot of the dashboards that we've built have been extremely helpful. I mean, be able to have like a single pane of glass that you can look at and you can tell you know, where the issues are, are all the schools up? I mean, I love walking in um, to the service desk and being able to see that board that shows every school has a green light on it so I know that they're up and they're functional. And it just doesn't mean that their network is good. It means that they've got pure internet all the way out from Google out to the actual classroom.